Hey everyone, this is James Wilson with Pedaling Innovations and today I wanted to show you how the foot position allowed by the catalyst pedal impacts rock strikes and what happens if you do happen to clip a rock. So when you're looking at foot position allowed by a normal small pedal, you're in this ball of the foot position. And when you do this and you go to put pressure into the pedal, your toe tips forward. This toe tipping forward position, this is a, a signature position for a, a lot of cyclists. And this is from the uneven forces going into the pedal. Now, when you move your foot forward and you use the midfoot position allowed by the catalyst pedal and you have pressure on both ends of your arch here, now you can see when I put pressure in, my foot tips forward much less. I'm much more even with the ground. And so, even though I've moved my foot for forward a little bit here, my toe doesn't tip down as far. So the net result is my toes and, and pedals are no more exposed to rock strikes than they were before. But that angle makes a big difference on what happens if I do clip a rock. If I'm in this ball of the foot position and my toes tip down and I clip a rock, I'm much more likely to get pinched between the rock and my pedal or get thrown forward because my foot's already tipping forward. But if I'm in this midfoot position and I happen to clip a rock, I'm much more likely to push forward and continue to go forward over the rock. So as you can see, the catalyst pedal in its foot position does not expose you to more uh, you know, foot and pedal strikes on rocks or other trail obstacles, and in fact makes a significant difference in what happens if you do happen to clip something. Again, this was a significant thing for me when I was uh, testing the catalyst pedal. The trails where we ride have a lot of rocks. I have clipped plenty of them. I have had bad wrecks caused by this, and so I definitely did not want to put a pedal out there that increased this risk factor. And again, I was happy to find out that it not only didn't increase it, but actually made it better. So once again, you can uh, check us out at pedalinginnovations.com where you can learn more about the science-based design behind the catalyst pedal and the benefits of the midfoot position. And uh, once again, it's been James Wilson, and I'll talk to everybody next time.